elsewhere, National Assembly Speaker Justin Muturi has proposed a radical reduction in the number of commissioners at the Independent Electoral and Boundaries Commission. Muturi said that he prefers the commissioners of the IABC be reduced from nine to just three to end regional interests in the commission and make it more efficient. The move is, however, being met with opposition from various quarters. Ben Kitili tells us why. Barely two years to the 2017 general election, Speaker of the National Assembly, Justin Muturi, has launched a campaign to slash the number of commissioners in the electoral body from the current nine to just three. A country of 40 million uh, people, nine commissioners, every day waking up pretending to be going to work. Which work, Masharia? Which work? I mean, is that Every day you are dealing with policy. When is this policy going to be implemented? Muturi hit out at the electoral body for what he called having too many commissioners simply for the sake of having regional balance. And just ask a question. Okay, so you are, you are coming to work on Monday. So that you go, do you have a meeting of the commission? No. So since you don't have a, com a meeting of the commission, what are you doing? Article 5 of the Independent Electoral and Boundaries Commission Act clearly states the composition of the IABC, that it shall consist of a chairperson and eight commissioners. The Isaac Hassan-led commission is currently composed of Lillian Mahiri Zaja, who is the vice chairperson, as well as commissioners Albert Bwire Kule Godana, Yusuf Nzibo, Abdullahi Sharawe, Thomas Letangule, Mudoni Wangai and Mohamed Dalawi. It's not clear if Muturi's proposal will gain consensus from Parliament. The MPs will have to amend the Independent Electoral and Boundaries Commission Act in order to reduce the number of commissioners. A country like India with 1.2 billion people, their electoral management body has set three or five commissioners. Go to South Africa. Go to Britain. However, chaired by Jenny Watson, the British Electoral Commission is currently composed of 10 commissioners including six permanent commissioners and four who serve on a part-time basis. In July last year, Parliament did consider a petition filed by activist Wafula Buke to have the nine commissioners removed from office on grounds of gross violation of the Constitution. Under the Okoa Kenya campaign, the opposition coalition court has also been calling for a reconstitution of the electoral body even threatening to boycott the 2017 elections if the IBC remains as currently constituted. The matter of who sits in the IBC is so complicated that even the traditional political party differences may disappear when the real debate begins on Muturi's proposal. Reforming the electoral body has been a topic before every major election for the last 20 years. Ben Kitili, KTN.